some 30,000 people live in the United Nations Protection of Civilians site in Malakal. Their daily struggle centers around security, shelter, access to clean water, and enough food rations and fears of their future. The current heavy rainy season has added to the daily wars for both the young and old. To witness firsthand these daily challenges and various humanitarian efforts on the ground, the United Nations peacekeeping chief, Jean-Pierre Lacroix, visited the Malakal Protection of Civilian Site as part of his three-day mission to South Sudan. Since its formation, this displaced people's site has offered refuge to hundreds of thousands of South Sudanese fleeing conflict around their homes. Salwa Dola Rihan has lived here since December 2013. With nowhere else to go, Rihan, through a translator, said she is secure here. <laughs> Chang Kwach, another displaced person in Malakal, on the other hand, says he misses many things. Conflict has continued to plague South Sudan since December 2013, and a brokered peace deal signed in August 2015 has not completely taken hold, causing hundreds of thousands to flee amidst burgeoning humanitarian challenges. Jean-Pierre Lacroix came to assess these challenges. Troops and officials on the ground briefed him on various security concerns, challenges and humanitarian efforts being made to assist the population in the area. Speaking at a press conference after his visit to Malakal, Lacroix said his meetings with local authorities in Malakal were positive and led to some agreements. We are uh, determined to continue doing our best uh, helping the population. We, uh, you know, my visit to Malakal uh, was uh, quite uh, uh, informative uh, uh, on the efforts that are being made there uh, to, uh, uh, to support uh, uh, the uh, uh, population there, the, the IDPs, but also the, the population as a whole, again, uh, 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 irrespective of their affiliations or, or anything else. Uh, and we had a good meeting with local authorities in Malakal, and uh, uh, we uh, agreed that we should continue work together and increase our cooperation in order to uh, help uh, the return of uh, stability and also uh, uh, generate better opportunities for the population there. Malakal state officials told the peacekeeping chief that the state government is currently engaged in intercommunal dialogue among the internally displaced, a step towards peace. Rihan and Kwach, who continue with their daily struggles as internally displaced, yearn for a normal life. Indeed, a normal life for these two and thousands of others displaced across the country would start with an immediate end to conflict, a necessity which Mr. Lacroix reiterated was crucial for peace and stability in South Sudan.